Okay, there we go again. I'm getting still in game. Yeah, here we go. I just played E4 just to really annoy him because he wanted to uh, smash it with Benko or something. He just completely ruined it with E4. <laughs> I'll play the um, Yours of Gambit if he lets me. Please, Knight of Six, yep. Hack him up with his Gambit. Ooh, that's not good. His Knight is not good at all. That's already a bad move. Now, is it Queen D5 now that wins or something? Is it Queen H5? Queen D5. This is interesting. Check. It's got three pieces on F2. I haven't got any more checks. But do I actually get mated? I do. Knight H3. Then Rook F8. So Knight F3, Queen takes F2, King D1. I don't think I don't think I quite get mated. Check. God, this is awful. <laughs> Got his pieces around my king around like move eight. We both took an F7 and F2, but the show has got to be a better way to punish Bishop C5. Show Queen D5 is just a blunder. At least I've not played E4 for that long. But if he isn't careful, I've got all sorts of stuff coming like Bishop G5 if he's not even moves. So this is a razor sharp position. We both sides have took an F2 and F7, but yet the other side got away with it. But now he's stuck on G2, attacking my rook, which hasn't got hardly any squares. Except maybe e1. But he's got knight f2. So it's like I'm lost. I've got rook f1. And then maybe I can sacrifice the exchange if he takes. I think I'll do that. Need to get something going fast. We're going to see a savage exchange if he goes knight f2. Oh, he's gone queen g6 instead. He's gone passive. But he is on material. Can't see the queen swap being any good for me. I have to do it though. I'm going to get hacked. But now he's opened the F file up towards my F2 point. But now I'm going to try and get a counter attack going with knight g5 for any knight f7. And if he takes bishop takes g5, check. So he has to be careful. What an aggressive game this is. 11 moves, just a massive hack him up. Right, so he's took an h2 as expected. Now, how can I win this game? Knight f7, king e7, and I've really got a follow up. I can't play Rook F8 because his bishop's on it. I'm just down a couple of pawns. This is rather dire. Maybe Bishop F4 just developing peace with tempo. Before probably resigning. <laughs> but he just um, took his knight as well. That was an idiot move. However, do I take his knight out of his book? If I take his knight, he comes like with check. I'll go with some kind of mating attack. And bishop takes h2, I can also play. So bishop takes g5, king e8, box, bishop f7. In fact, I'm going to take the knight. And then, the brutal finish. What <laughs> a brutal finish there. <laughs> <laughs> that is just a brilliant finish there, I just love it. <laughs> anyway, um, please leave any comments or thoughts. Thanks very much. No, oh, sorry, we'll go for it first. <laughs> what a game this was. <laughs> takes, takes. That, thinking I've won. Uh oh, we can just take, I have to give up F2, we we'll check. check. And then, I could just have took his knight, so that was a bit idiotic. So he does that and then I've got 
But I think he was busted anyway. And then checkmate with that pin. Anyway, um, please leave any comments and thoughts. Thanks very much.